tasting like a boss, still in Burlington, Vermont, and I'm at a different coffee shop. I just did a review of another coffee at a pizza, pizza restaurant, so this might sound better. I got some music in the background, but it's not as loud. Start the other one was a little quiet. And I'm at a place called Crew, K-R-U, Crew Coffee. Now, I'm not gonna be drinking this flavor. I use this in the thumbnail, because look at that name. Doom Cup Blend, so awesome, but not as awesome possibly as you know, dark as hell. Now, I purchased these guys. These are coming home with me back to Florida, and we're gonna be doing three-way reviews of these, there's no doubt. I really like the vibe in this place a lot. Um, this, in fact, I got a shirt. I don't even know if the coffee's good yet. I don't, do not know. The vibe was sweet, and I just, look at that, look at that. Atlas Blend, it's one of their dark roasts. They make their espresso out of that, they said. And I just thought that was pretty sweet. So be ready to see that in one of the reviews in the future. And of course, these here. Now, about the company, okay, it's a family-owned company. Their beans are roasted in Saratoga Springs, New York by the brother. The two sisters own the stores, or one, two of the stores. Uh, they're, let me see, I gotta, you gotta get them right. <clears throat> okay, one sister owns the one here in Burlington, Vermont. One sister owns the one in Saratoga Springs and is in Saratoga Springs and the beans are roasted and the other place is in Glens Falls, New York. These are all places I anticipate driving through and being by at some point this summer. So kind of excited about that. And I'm also excited about what we're drinking today, okay? This is special, I think. It is a blend. It is a trifecta blend nitro cold brew. Again, I'm really liking what's going on here in Vermont. That when they give you a cold brew, they tell you what they're using as opposed to just cold brew and you're getting a cold brew coffee black and that's it. Well, this is a cold brew coffee. It is black. It's nitro though which creates that creaminess without cream, right? And what this is, is a blend of three coffees. It's a blend of their Colombian, their Guatemalan, and their Ethiopian. Uh, is that right? Yeah, good. So, I got the three coffee blend, three coffee blend with a nitro cold brew. I haven't had anything like that. The smell on it's heavenly. I mean, it's really good. Okay, so, here we go, fingers crossed. They're so nice to me that if it's not good, I feel bad because they're so nice. The manager here was so great and the vibe is so awesome. That it's like I'm, I'm rooting for it. But I'll tell you if it's good or not. If it's bad, maybe I won't post it. Uh, hopefully it's good. Tasting like a boss. So good. Guys, okay, how, can, how to explain it? Um, I like that there's still some bitterness to it. Sometimes the nitro cold brews I get kind of take away that little bit of bitter I do desperately want to have in my coffee. The blend here is nice because it just complements. Nothing is overpowering, and yet it's not one of those flavors where it's dancing all around in my mouth. Sometimes I like to have that. Sometimes I like to have that feeling of it dancing all around in my mouth. Here are the three flavors, the three roasts, work in unison, so it tastes like one defined flavor, but it's mellow and smooth. For me, note-wise, bitterness at the end, but just, just a touch. I'm not getting tobacco notes. That's fine. Yeah, I like that. I, I, I like it a lot. So, hey, all right. So, if you find yourself in Burlington, Vermont, first of all, great area. I've never been here before. Uh, it's down at the end of Church Street, uh, near the Unitarian Church. In fact, I'm looking at the Unitarian Church. I think that's what it is. Um, come on in. Look at the vibe is great. Look at that there. It's so cool. Uh, and the uh, coffees I'm looking forward to. The shirt I'll probably wear. So I'm a fan. I'm a convert. 
They're really, really good, and they got a whole bunch of other flavors as well. I'll put a link to the website below. Until next time, people, next time you see me, I'll probably be in Florida. <laughs> and I'll probably have a chihuahua on my lap. So keep tasting like a boss. Thanks so much.